Hi everyone, this is Jane here from Crystal Sparkles Readings to just do our day 12 of um, Vlogmas and um, yeah, let's have a little shuffle and see what we've got. So I've got one that jumped out as I was shuffling it. So we'll have that one if I can reach it. <coughs> there we go. So our card for Vlogmas Day 12 is, there we go, the beautiful world card. So the world is a fantastic card for us to have. Excuse me, just having a little drink. <coughs> um... Because it talks about, you know, the world kind of being your oyster, really. You know, having that kind of energy where you can do anything and you can achieve anything. The world is at your feet. The world is your oyster. Those are the sayings that always spring to mind when I get the world. It talks about the completion of a cycle as well. And, um, you know, as we're coming up to Christmas, end of the year, um... We are coming up to that, you know, we're coming up to that completion of a cycle. Um, so it's worth bearing in mind that it's worth using some time to reflect on, um, you know, how far we've come and did we get the things done that we wanted to get done? Um, did we achieve what we wanted to achieve? All of that kind of stuff. Um, it's a good time to have a little reflect upon that. Um, I'll just show you these cats because they are just so snoozy at the moment. There's Merlin. There he is. And there's Chinook, all snoozied up. They're so comfortable. Merlin is awake. He's watching everything I'm doing. Um, Dave's just not really coming around. Are you going to sleep, Merlin? Oh, he's so cute. So the world is about that. It's about completion and, um, you know, sort of completing that cycle. So, you know, just bear in mind that on this 12th day of Vlogmas that you might be sort of looking at what you've completed, getting things finished, um, but also thinking about what you want to achieve because, you know, the world does say you can do all of it. You can enjoy all of it. You can have all of it. You can do all of it. Um, so it's a really lovely positive card for us to have. So I'll just open up our little mindfulness jar and see what we've got on this um, on this one. So we've got a little Merry Christmas message on this one. And our message is, how Christmassy do you feel? Let's look out of the window. How Christmassy do you feel? Whether your answer is very or not at all, the big day is hurtling towards us and there will already be several indications of that fact outside. Get things started with a mindful seeing exercise. Sit by a window for five minutes and just look out. First, can you see anything that signifies Christmas? Is there frost on the ground? Are there lights and decorations anywhere? Focus on these things. Do they increase your festive anticipation? Are there any signs of Christmas that you never noticed before? What thoughts and emotions do they evoke? Next, channel all your awareness into the other things you can see. Avoid simply labelling things and moving on um, for each object, no matter how familiar. Observe the shape, the colour, the patterns and the texture. Notice how the elements interact with the environment, how the wind blows the branches of the trees, for example. Try to imagine the view from the perspective of someone who's never seen such sights. This exercise will help you see and appreciate your local environment and realise just how busy and complete it is. That is really, really true. Um, and very, it's, it's very interesting um, to do that. And I do that quite a bit because um, I, I, look, I like looking out the window. Um, so 
I know you, you know sort of talked about cats and stuff before but cats will literally sit and stare out of a window for hours um and I think we can sort of learn something from them really because they're kind of a little bit like zen masters aren't they they just look out of the window and they'll they're just like chilled out looking out of the window um and funnily enough I was looking out of the window the other evening um and actually did notice some Christmas lights that I had not seen there before so um that they were really pretty and that was a really nice Christmassy thing to see um the people opposite me used to always do their house really really lovely but they haven't done it for the last few years and I'm always really disappointed because I'm like put your lights up please um I just love seeing all of that sort of stuff so yeah have a look outside your window and you know even if you can't get out and about very much you can still look out of your window and there's still lots to be seen um, to be able to look out and just take it in um, and kind of almost realise that we're part of part of a big wide world where there's a lot going on even if you're looking outside and you think there's nothing going on just imagine what's going on under the earth you know with all the worms and all the all the little critters that live under the earth you know that's a whole different little world down there look up in the sky where the birds are Oh, you know, there's a whole world up there as well. There's a whole world in the trees where the squirrels are jumping around. So the the world outside your window is much bigger than you think it is or that you may believe it is. Um, so, yeah, what a lovely message. Hopefully you've enjoyed that one for today. And I'll be back again tomorrow to do another one. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Um, and if you really enjoy this kind of thing, please do subscribe to my channel. And I'll be back tomorrow to do another one. Bye for now.